What is going on everyone? It's TG Smooth and welcome back to another episode of Grounded Guys and man do we have a lot of news and a lot to showcase today so this is going to be all the new weapons and armors with the full release that we know of. Um, I am in creative mode right now so I went ahead and crafted some of the stuff up and I'll just briefly showcase it guys. Um, the new tier 3 club is going to be the fire ant club. Um, so they're going to be adding fire ants into the game. I guess there are going to be termites. This is from the termite king perhaps. Um, once we get into the menu I'll show you. And then we have the scythe of blossoms which is... Hold on, let's see if I can go... Boop. Yeah, there we go. And maybe go into orbital? Uh, do they have orbital? No. Alright, but this is fine. At least you can see it. So, they have that. They have a toenail scimitar. Scimitar. Whoa! Uh, no. It does not chop. Okay, so. And then we have the black ox crossbow, which looks pretty sweet. Um, I'm glad we got a tier 3 crossbow. That's, that's super awesome. But the things I'm most excited for, guys... Um, <laughs> as far as weapons, they came out with a new weapon type, and that is Sour. And there are three staffs, a Fire, Mint, and Sour one, and this thing, just look at it, man. That looks freaking awesome. Unfortunately, I don't have bugs in here, so I can't exactly show you what it does. I, I kind of want to keep that a surprise anyways, because this is a huge spoiler. Um, anytime you go in creative and you can check what they added with the updates and stuff. Um, that is the spicy staff, maybe? Spicy staff, I want to say. Uh, yes, that's exactly what it's called. But it's just like a bombardier beetle, but lava, which is freaking amazing. Look at that. It just looks super powerful. Um, and then this one, I... I'm not too sure about like I mean if maybe something was following you and you could just like I don't know run away and I don't know how that will work but I'm super excited for the sour staff and then they do have all the other weapons let's just go ahead and go into the crafting menu and that way I can better showcase them so starting from the top um hold on was not expecting that. Forgot to turn off my notifications. We have the fire ant club. So it's going to take fire ant parts, which means there is a new ant type. Um, then the tick machete, holy crap, um, requires tick fangs, pine cone pieces. So that's new. And it looks pretty baller. Life steal. It has life steal on it, just like the mosquito needle. So we'll see how that works. Then the Scythe of Blossoms, of course, um, that requires rust, so rust is pretty new. Maybe we get those from the nail or that rusty chair up on the uh, porch, the barn door. Um, the Toenail Scimitar, rust, toenails. So there is, I remember an ashtray up on the table, there's candy corns, maybe we'll find toenail clippers in there. Um, the Widow Dagger, so Black Widow Fangs and Lint Rope, Super Spider Venom. So that's going to be pretty nasty. The Rusty Spare, Sunken Bone, Rust, and Dite Mutt's Fuzz. Um, like I said, the there's a new damage type, so that's Sour. They have a Sour Battle Axe, which is pretty dope. And then the Tiger Mosquito Rapier. Rapier. <laughs> Alright, so that's all the Tier 3 stuff for the weapons and then when you scroll down that's when you start getting the ranged which is the staffs and stuff so there's the three staffs um, they don't look like they require much to craft so pond moss fire ant mandibles and um, pond moss uh, okay so I know I'm going to a pond first thing the black ox crossbow once again pine cone pieces is the only thing new there um, let's go down here. There's no tier 3 explosive. Uh, no better torches. There are two better shields. The fire ant shield, which should be expected since the black ant shield. And the ladybird shield. Um, I guess ladybirds now drop shells, so that's new. Before they didn't 
they just dropped regular ladybug parts so they changed that a bit and then it's same as armor um, we're gonna have like Sarah's charm that's completely new that's something to do with Dr. Tolly I'm guessing and maybe an in-game item because right elf charm and left elf charm sounds like pretty two unique pieces um, and then you have the fire ant armor which is gonna be new the wizard hat I'm guessing yes that gives staff stuff so staff parry window um, and that's not gonna take much you could actually already potentially have the parts ready to make that wizard hat I know I do um, the moth wrap, so the moth armor, the black ox helm is new, fluffy pupa hat, and then that's about it. So the fire ant armor, I believe the assassin is the mantis armor, and then the black ox armor. Um, that looks like medium armor, charge attack, weaken. Okay, so I like using charged attacks a lot because I like the clubs. Um, so that black ox armor actually sounds pretty useful for that and then we have tier 3 spider armor the widow armor Okay, so that gives poison damage that looks like it would be useful for the uh, brood mother hat and Then going down here See if we got anything special like aphid slippers or anything like that. That's just off the wall. No, we don't um, but a little two two new pieces for the pets so that's cool and then in here we have a flare that flares new and the orcus manis kebab okay so that's actually gonna take broodmother chunks um, to summon the manis boss so just keep that in mind you're gonna have to beat the broodmother at least like five times I don't I think it gives like one chunk I'm not a hundred percent positive on that so that's about all of the new weapons and armors I'm just gonna go breeze through here is there anything past mushroom ash <coughs> excuse me ash cement okay so there's ash walls um, we get a new building structure type that's pretty cool um, yeah, so, it is what it is, guys. This is, um, they came out with a crap ton of new weapons, which I, I thought they would, um, come out with, like, more armor and stuff, but it seems like we get, what, three, two, three, maybe four new sets? Who knows? Um, they could add stuff that's kind of, like, totally off the wall secret that you might not be able to see in creative for some reason I don't know but um, it is what it is guys but I hope you enjoyed this little uh, preview of or showcase of all the new weapons um, these staffs look like they're pretty cool and I gotta get to work on finding these in games but I do plan on coming out with guides for all this stuff guys um, so make sure you subscribe to the channel and be on the lookout for those videos but that's it for today i hope you guys enjoyed the episode and as usual remember to stay smooth peace